guys welcome back to my channel my name is Maritza if you guys are new don't forget to subscribe down below also in this video my son will be in the background I'm actually in his room currently so we have all kinds of toys everywhere so he is just gonna be in the background of this video playing and you guys might hear him so if you guys hear a bunch of noise then that's what that is so for today's video you guys can already tell what the video is about I'm doing a Q&A video it's gonna be kind of like an updated version because the last time I did a Q&A was probably back in March, April. So I thought I would do like an updated version of this. Um, and I asked you guys on Instagram and Snapchat to send me your questions. I think I also got a few on YouTube. Um, but let me look at the questions and I will be glad to answer them for you guys. So um, the first question is by... Nicolasa Vega on Instagram and she asked a few questions. She asked, how did you and Leo meet? So me and my husband, that's Leo, um, met on social media. Um, he did come over to my house and we got to like know each other. After that, he kept coming over like twice or three times a week. And then from there, you know, the rest is history basically. So she also asked, do you want more babies? So I do. I come from a big family. Um, there were seven total, counting my mom and my dad. So there was five of us, brothers and sisters. So I would personally want a big family, maybe four kids, honestly. Um, obviously, only God knows how many more kids I will have, but um, I do want more kids. And then she also asked, what's the hardest thing about parenting? So I think that the hardest thing about parenting for me was probably back when he was a newborn and having to... Um, stay up all night because he wouldn't sleep like he wouldn't sleep through the night for like the first month and a half of his life basically and i think having to uh, go on throughout your day basically with no rest that was probably one of the hardest things but luckily now you know he sleeps through the night and all of that so that's over with so she also asks how do you and hubby maintain your relationship so i personally think that me and my husband talk things through really well um when there's like doubt or like a trust issue or just anything at all we always talk it through and those are all the questions that she asked but um mama loves for on instagram heather asked what's your dream job so i think my dream job honestly would probably be youtube like being able to record things and videos that i want and you guys are actually like you know interested and being like maybe big on YouTube to be able to like earn a living doing something that I love to do I think that would be amazing um, if it's not YouTube I really like kids so maybe like a teaching job or some type of job that deals with kids so um, who inspired she also asked who inspires you on YouTube actually you do um, Darlene She's one of my really good friends here. Um, Super Just TV, she really inspires me as well. And also Life as a Mommy, her name's Abby or Abigail. Uh, she inspires me as well. So I think I can take a lot from each of you guys. She also asked who are some of your favorites to watch. Um, obviously you, basically the ones I just said, Darlene, uh, Super Just TV, and Life as a Mommy. I do also watch like the Ace Family's videos. Um, as far as like makeup channels that I watch, I love James Charles videos. They're really creative and inspirational in the way that, you know, it's like art and he's talking about like, like so many different things all the time. Okay, so those are all the questions that she asked. Okay, so Smitten with Juju or Marisol asked on Instagram. Uh, what's your favorite genre of music? I'm gonna have to say uh, Christian music. I pretty much only listen to Christian music to be quite honest um, She also has a beauty product you can't live without So I'd have to say a mascara no matter if I don't have eyeliner or like foundation or something like that Like I just cannot be without mascara. I actually just bought one today because I'm running out of mascara So she also asked baby names you love but didn't use on David <clears throat> She asked some really good questions. So thank you for that. Um, we were gonna name David David D'Angelo But his middle name is now Robert and that's actually because that's um, the name of one of my husband's cousins who passed away. So I really like D'Angelo. And if it was a girl, we were going to name her Mia. So um, she also asked favorite dish to cook. I think my favorite dish to cook is enchiladas de pollo, which is chicken enchiladas. 
Um, if you guys know me, you guys know I make that quite often. My husband really likes enchiladas de pollo as well, so that's why I make that so often. Um, so my favorite hobby, probably, honestly, one of my favorite hobbies is YouTube, because, you know. Um, I really enjoy being outside, so being out in nature, um, it just gives you, like, a whole new sense of, like, the world, because sometimes we're just so trapped like either in our phones or just at home or in the same routine basically but when you actually go outside and breathe the fresh air and stuff it just reminds you of like how beautiful it is outside as well um she also asked how do you get private time with significant other now that you're a mommy so basically when david is asleep we get to hang out watch a movie or whatever we want so those are all the questions that she asked um darlene montes asked where do you see yourself in five years? And this is Darlene, the one who I was talking about. I'm pretty sure you guys, if you guys follow me, I'm pretty sure you guys follow her. If you don't, go ahead and follow all these girls that I did mention. Um, she asked, where do you see yourself in five years? So as far as YouTube, I think I'm going to say um, hopefully, hopefully at five, ten, fifteen thousand. I don't really know. I would have wanted to, you know, it to become my career by then. Um, and as far as just myself, maybe working somewhere because David will be like seven by then um so he would be in school and I would either have time to be like a teacher or like some work, work doing something obviously not just staying home um and she also asked what are your short-term goals I'm not really sure if you're asking as far as YouTube or just in general um but if it's as far as YouTube being like reaching maybe 5,000 pretty soon and then another question I got from super just TV on Instagram was what are you currently watching on Netflix honestly I'm not watching any um, shows I did watch Grey's Anatomy I finished that whole thing I'm gonna start watching Jane the Virgin though I love that show and I think that there's new episodes that I have not caught up on myself so I'm gonna go ahead and do that and she did say any shows you recommend because I watched almost everything so maybe if you haven't already watched Grey's Anatomy watch that one and Jane the Virgin so yeah, I'm gonna check YouTube real quick because I know I had uh, like a question or two there okay so my sister asked Monica Vaina on YouTube asked have you considered furthering your education if so what career path would you take so um, her and Heather kind of asked similar questions um, I have I think that the best time for me to go to school would probably be when David starts school as well honestly probably like a teacher or something with kids maybe even of like a pediatrician or some something like that not honestly not 100% sure but yeah so I think that's all the questions I gotta double check real quick yeah I think that's all the questions that I got there wasn't that many people but they did ask a few questions so I was like I'm gonna go ahead and film it now and thank you guys for all the questions that you guys sent over if you guys did not send your questions in and you guys still want to ask something then be sure to leave it down in the comments and I will reply as soon as I can but thank you guys so much for watching. That is it for today's video. I will see you guys in the next one.